Like the depth of the ocean below the restless waves, there is a permanent peace and stillness that dwells deep beneath the turbulence of your thinking mind. Your true identity is too often hidden by your thoughts and your ego. You will never find lasting peace and fulfillment until you come to an acceptance of who you really are. Shakespeare understood this when he wrote, To thine own self be true. And many years before Shakespeare, Socrates said, To know thyself is the beginning of wisdom. Your true self is like a movie screen in a theater. Although dramas and comedy and horror and tragedy are all projected onto the screen, they never become a part of the screen. The color red may be displayed, but it does not color or stain the screen. The screen always remains separate from the movie. It always remains still and peaceful, although the movie may be violent and chaotic. If the screen were aware, it would know who it is. It's not the movie. Although the movie is reflected on its surface, the screen always remains who it is, separate from the movie. The movie screen remains the same. Though horror, comedy, or shame may be expressed upon its peaceful face, the story played out on the screen will change and move from scene to scene as action quickly moves from place to place. But when the movie finally ends, the hero is the one who wins, and endless credits slowly fade away. The movies come, the movies go. The laughter rings, the tears will flow. And yet, the screen is always there to stay. Your essence, like the movie screen, is always peaceful and serene. You're not the endless tales that come and go. Retreat behind illusion's face, and you will find amazing grace, because you are the screen and not the show. Movies will come and go, but the screen remains the same. If you can learn to allow the movies to play without viewing them as your identity, you will not be tossed around by your thoughts and emotions. They will come and go like the movies, but you will remain stable and peaceful. The magic key that enables you to separate your thoughts and feelings from who you really are is awareness. The moment you become aware of your thoughts, you've taken the first step towards self-realization. Most people are completely dominated by their thinking and are not even aware of it. When you realize the difference between conscious awareness and uncontrolled thinking, you will begin to experience the peace that has always been a part of who you really are. You cannot come into awareness by thinking, but you can become aware by simply withdrawing from thought into the depths of who you are. You are the awareness. Your mind is constantly searching for identity, like the character in a movie who's looking for the screen, or a fish who's swimming around searching for water. Stop searching for who you are and simply be. As Shakespeare wrote so long ago, to be or not to be, that is the question. Recognize that you are the screen on which all the movies are played. Those movies are your continual thoughts. You are neither the hero nor the villain that your thoughts create. Withdraw from thought and sink into awareness and you will experience indescribable peace, contentment, regardless of the movies that play on your screen and that you encounter. And always remember, you are the screen, not the movie. <laughs>